I'm Philo, the Good Days of News and Rumors. Welcome and do subscribe. So, <laughs> let's talk about hashtag Shimza must fall. If you don't know how this happened, okay? This is how it happened. Where do I start? Let's start where Shimza actually apparently allegedly went to channel o and said hey since there is a lockdown starting let's start a house party type of a program whereas i think it's called lockdown party or channel o lockdown party something like that i'm not sure i don't watch it but last week i saw a trend on twitter i saw a trend on facebook and even on instagram it was all over the place people were talking about it especially the miss cosmo said apparently she blew out the place but anyway let's talk we were talking about shimza and not miss cosmo okay so this particular program plays on channel o on friday and saturday apparently allegedly supposedly from six o'clock until 12 o'clock midnight I just said apparently allegedly supposedly I'm not sure I'm not sure but I think that's what channel O said on one of their ads so what happens in the show Shimza is actually the host and he brings all his friends DJ Zinke, Abu, you know all the other DJs and whoever whichever artist that he decides to bring on the show to play a set or two or three whatever sits like it's prepared on the table so a guy not sure where he's from but he actually went on twitter okay and said his name is siga um sigawa mar Meropa. Mar yeah sigawa Meropa. he actually went on twitter and tweeted he said i'm asking shimza to invite me on one of his lockdown shows since the president extended okay he also says i'm also asking everyone who sees this tweet to retweet as we all know how twitter works People retweet things so that whoever, they, so that they get attention, you understand? So that's why he was asking people to retweet so that Shimza can actually see, you understand what I'm trying to say? Since she, Shimza has a lot of followers and obviously people are talking about him and taking him left, right and center. So for him, for the tweet to gain traction so that Shimza can see it, it needs to be retweeted. But that's where Shimza's downfall comes through. He replied to his particular tweet saying, you need to stop harassing me, it's annoying. South Africa went crazy mad. They are mad at Shimza for actually doing this particular, I mean, replying the way he did. People think that now that he made it, he forgets where he comes from. Bearing in mind that um, um, DJ Fresh, there was a, there was it was a DJ Fresh DJ Oskido okay DJ Oskido was having a particular performance and he asked if Shimza can actually do a 15 minute set so that he introduces Ushimza to the crowd and that's how he started to blow up so people were saying humble beginnings you should help other people get to where you are because you were once there you understand what i'm trying to say so that's why people are mad because he cannot help he someone asked for his help but he's acting all you know <laughs> he's big-headed basically that's what people were saying on twitter so people are mad and annoyed by his response towards that whole entire situation but Siga was being the most humble human on earth Siga Wamiropa and said thanks I will stop annoying you he actually also went on Facebook I think I saw that post um, on Twitter somewhere where he said that he asked people that he said actually he said that he doesn't understand why Shimza is acting like um, he's been tweeting him every day he says this is the first time he actually mentioned him on a tweet he also said that people should stop retweeting that tweet because he doesn't want to get into the wrong side of ushimza and whatever it is because it will he felt like it will impact his hustle but you know when jesus says yes nobody can say no because Gagazi FM, okay, Gagazi FM, I just want to read the tweet, I'm just going to find the tweet very quickly so that I can read it to you exactly what they literally said to him. Where is it? Gagazi FM said, hey, Sigawami Ropa 1, how are you, how, how are your, I wanted to say your, how are your Tuesdays looking like for a month's residency on that drive KZN? Imagine, someone tried to shut you up. But God was like, there's a bigger, greater door for you, darling. So, I don't know if this guy replied to Gagazi FM, but it seems like doors are actually opening. This reminds me of the KFC wedding a lot because 
remember they were being brought down by someone and the whole entire country prepared a whole beautiful wedding ceremony and buses that were supposed to carry guests to that particular wedding so this reminds me of exactly what it is if you are someone out there and you are living the or you're trying to get to where you are and you're asking people and they're just shutting doors in front of you just know that it was not meant to be god has a bigger greater plan for you just be patient wait and keep on hustling and keep on pushing but anyway tell me what you think about this whole entire situation at the com at the comment section down below i have another scoop I have another Shimza scoop re, um, regarding K Naomi. It's gonna come. I think I'm gonna put it down here if you wanna see it. Um, I didn't know this existed, but then let's check it out and let's talk at the comment section. But tell me in the comment section, do you think that Shimza's. Wait, he actually apologized. What was I doing? People were also mad at Shimza's apology, guys. He wrote an apology. Um, he's saying, I apologize for snapping at you, especially uh, because I am a hustler myself. I should have been more understanding. Mm -hmm. Yes, you should have. I was in no way um, a personal attack or anything of that sort. That is what James has said. He continued on by saying, I take nothing for granted. Everything I do is to deliver the best I can for everyone that loves music. To... Siga wa miropa one. Keep pushing, bro. We remain soldiers of the same struggle. But people didn't buy. Twitter didn't buy the apology. They actually came back at him and saying that is a lousy apology. You could have done something better. But tell me in the comment section down below. Do you think that what Shinza has obviously what he did was wrong so i don't know why i'm asking this stupid question but tell me at the same comment section down below do you think that what he did was actually caught for and do you think that what gagazi fm did was the best thing for this particular guy tell me in the comment section down below and i'll see you guys on the next one i will see you guys on the next one have a good day and bye